Please adhere to YouTube's selected guidelines before viewing content of this video. I do not encourage or condone any products, actions, or behaviors shown in this video. All videos are produced in a safe, professional, and controlled environment. Please do not attempt to replicate any actions performed during the video. All actions are performed by professionals. Alrighty, so today I rolled a cigarette with toilet paper, and now I'm going to be smoking it to get rid of my horrible diarrhea. Do I actually have diarrhea right now? No, thankfully not. Thankfully, I do not actually have diarrhea right now. As if I actually had diarrhea right now, while well, I wouldn't be making this video today because I'd be sitting on the toilet. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Uh, if I was gonna record this video, I would literally be sitting on the toilet recording this video. But what are my expectations for this experience? Well, I'm not really thinking that it's going to be the greatest experience in the world, in all honesty. Toilet paper is certainly by no means not the thickest thing in the world. This is not single-ply toilet paper. I think I think this is like double-ply toilet paper. So it's definitely not the thinnest toilet paper either. Uh, but toilet paper in general is definitely not like the thinnest paper in the world, that is for sure. And the consistency of it when compared to rolling paper is just so different that I'm not really thinking it's going to smoke the greatest, nor do I think it's really going to taste all that good kind of thing. The consistency, the texture of toilet paper is more a like cloth than it is actual like paper, like rolling paper and everything like that kind of thing. So as such, I'm not really sure how this experience is going to go. I don't think this cigarette is going to taste very good. I definitely don't think it's going to burn the best, but if it does burn well, I think it's going to burn really, really, really fast. Overall, as I'm sure you guys can tell, I'm not really expecting the greatest experience in the world. But uh, nonetheless, I am still very, very, very excited to, well, finally smoke a cigarette rolled with toilet paper. This is actually a video I've been wanting to make for a while. I think it's just absolutely hilarious rolling a cigarette with toilet paper and then smoking it. I think it's an absolutely hilarious concept. And so I am very, very, very happy to uh, finally be making this video today. That is for sure. Uh, but I do think without further ado, let's go ahead and get this cigarette right here, all it up, and let's go ahead and see if smoking a cigarette rolled with toilet paper can actually clear, can actually clear, can actually cure my diarrhea or not. Although thankfully, I don't actually have any diarrhea. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get this lit up. Yes, sir, yes, sir, you know what I'm saying, I'm saying. Right off the bat, I did roll this very tight. I will admit, maybe a little bit too tight. I ain't gonna lie. And right off the bat, I'm getting no smoke from it. I think I might have made a mistake that I've made before and uh, rolled this cigarette way too tight. I think I rolled this cigarette way too tight. I ain't gonna lie. Uh, let's go ahead and see if I can just fix that a little bit. I'm just gonna try to go like this a little bit and just try to fix it just like that just try to get it where there's some air maybe i just compacted it a little bit too much kind of thing that is my bad i ain't gonna lie that is my bad let's see if i can go and take a hit though <sighs> nothing nothing I'm getting nothing. I made a huge mistake. I rolled this way too tight. It is what it is, though, I do suppose. It is what it is, though. I cannot believe me. I really did roll this cigarette right here way too tight. Well, I am real quick gonna go ahead and get myself a little bit of a screenshot, and then after that, I'm gonna go ahead and try to fix uh, the, the problem with this cigarette right off the bat. And yeah, no, still nothing. Ashing it, the ash falls off personally, per perfectly fine, but I think that it's more just kind of like burning um, than I am really actually smoking it in all honesty. Yeah, I definitely did, 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 I definitely did. I definitely did roll this a little bit too tight. Whoopsies, that's my fault. I really, I really gotta get better about that. I ain't gonna lie y'all. I feel like I got some smoke on that one, but I couldn't see any when I was when I exhaled. But I could feel roughness in the back of my throat, like I was actually getting something in my throat. But let me tell y'all what, I was having to draw on this so hard that for some reason it started hurting my teeth. That's not a very good sign, I ain't gonna lie, y'all.
Well, this is definitely curing my diarrhea and <laughs> I can't, I can't keep saying that. I can't keep saying it. This is definitely curing. Uh, this is definitely curing my diarrhea in, in one way because it's not allowing me to get any nicotine. So without nicotine, I can't poop. <laughs> uh, uh. I'm not getting any smoke, so I'm not going to get any nicotine. So I'm not going to need to take a nick poop or nothing like that. Right? Right? That's what I'm saying. I can't keep it together. I've got... I've got a 12-year-old's um, sense of humor, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. You say poop and I laugh. You say pee-pee and I laugh. Yeah. <sighs> Nothing. I am wondering if it's not just the fact that I rolled this really tight, because if I rolled this this tight with normal rolling paper, it'd be just fine. It would probably have a really tight draw, but it would be just fine. And here's the thing. The draw off of this cigarette is actually not really all that tight. It's actually pretty wide open, which is really surprising coming from a cigarette that is giving me no draw at all. So here's what I'm actually thinking is happening. I'm not getting any smoke, because the paper itself is, of course, not designed to be used as rolling paper. And it is, it, the, I want to say that toilet paper probably has a bunch of little tiny holes all over it where the air is escaping from. Of course, toilet paper is meant to be infinitely compactable, essentially, kind of thing. And to do that, you need to make sure that the air comes out of the paper in itself out of the air gaps between the paper itself and so as such there's air gaps in the actual toilet paper itself which means that i can't get the smoke to come all the way through because the, my just my draw is just escaping just as soon as it kind of as soon as i try to draw the smoke in it's just escaping through these little holes right here and everything like that kind of thing and so it's just not working and i'm thinking that's why uh, this little experiment has been a little bit of a uh, has been a little bit of a failure. I almost said success. This is by no means being a success. This has very much been a failure. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. I am quite disappointed. I did actually want to smoke uh, a toilet paper cigarette in today's video, um, but but yeah, it doesn't work. You can't smoke it. I haven't gotten a single hit off off of this thing. It's been funny to do, but it doesn't work. Well, I expected it to at least smoke a little bit kind of thing. But um, I, I expected to at least be able to get a couple hits off of it or something like that kind of thing. But no, <laughs> you can't even smoke this. It's just not even possible, it seems. I think once we get like down to like this point or something like that kind of thing, I think I'll be able to take a hit or two. But um, at the moment, I don't think I'm going to be able to take any hits. And that really is very much a disappointment, I ain't going to lie, y'all. And yeah, everything I'm drawing in is very cold as well, which makes me think that when I'm drawing in, oh, I get what's going on now. It's not that the smoke is escaping. It's that my draw is actually not even reaching this. What I'm drawing is like the air from like right here. And it's kind of chilly today. And yeah, when I just normally breathe in, it feels about the same. So what I'm actually drawing in is the air from like this point of the cigarette, not up here because of the air holes in the in the toilet paper. Yeah, you literally cannot smoke a cigarette rolled with toilet paper. I really did think you could. In all honesty, I really did think you could. And um, well, I have certainly learned my lesson in today's video. That is for sure. You cannot roll a cigarette with what well, you can roll a cigarette with toilet paper. You just can't smoke it. I've learned my lesson in today's video. That is for sure. You, you cannot smoke a cigarette rolled, rolled with toilet paper. Um, that is quite a shame, I ain't gonna lie, as I actually really did want to smoke a cigarette rolled to toilet paper in today's video. And I am gonna just continue letting it burn, because I do at least want to try to get one or two hits. But, yeah, this is definitely a failure. You, you can't realistically roll a cigarette with toilet paper. Would I recommend any of y'all try this at home if you're out of rolling papers? Hell no! Hell no! This don't even work! I'm literally just wasting tobacco right now. Hell no! I'm still getting nothing. Let's try. That actually worked a little bit. So what I tried to do there was cover up. It's a 
bug him. Get the fuck up. Bug was j jumped on me and then it jumped right off. So weird. I thought it was going to try to bite me or something. Weird bug. It was like a jumping bug or something like that. It wasn't a jumping spider. Uh, but what I try to do right there is cover up as much of the cigarette paper as possible to try to make sure that my draw reaches the ash. And that actually worked, kind of. It didn't work super well, but it kind of worked. And yeah, I'd have to say right off the bat, that's not even really working all that well, but I am actually able to get some of the taste now and it's not very good. It's really, really, really rough, really rough. Tastes like absolute crap. Um, and you can't taste any of the tobacco at all. Don't, don't, don't try this at home. Don't do it. This is a terrible experience. Terrible experience, absolutely horrible. Look at how much, look at how little tar, this should have been the hint that my draw wasn't even reaching or anything. Look at how little tar has come through the cigarette filter. Almost nothing, almost nothing. Wow, this has been such a disappointment. <sighs> but now that we're getting towards the bottom, I can actually smoke this a little bit. Still not very well, but I can actually smoke it a little bit. And, um, yeah, no, it tastes terrible. Wow. This has got to be one of the driest tasting cigarettes I've ever had, which is kind of weird to say driest tasting. It's just like burning the back of my throat kind of thing. It's just like so dry in the back of my throat. And then the taste of the paper is terrible as well kind of thing. Really, really, really rough. Terrible experience. No, I'm never doing this again. Do I even think that this experience cured my diarrhea? No, no it didn't, because I wasn't even able to take a couple hits that were good sized hits. Ain't no way this cured my diarrhea. Wow, this is clogging up my nose too. I don't know if it's actually clogging up my nose, but my nose is getting clogged up now. Yeah, no, this is not a good experience. I think I'm gonna try to take one more hit and I'm just gonna put this out kind of thing. This is that bad. This is genuinely that bad of an experience. That was a good sized hit though. All right, yeah, I'm stubbing this out. No, I'm done. I'm done. This was terrible. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna go and stub that out real quick. Yeah, no, this was um, not a pleasant experience. Let me tell y'all what, not a pleasant experience at all. Uh, would I roll a cigarette with toilet paper and smoke it again? No. No, I would not. One, I couldn't even get any draw off of the cigarette for the, like, 90% of the cigarette kind of thing. For 90% of the cigarette, I couldn't even take a hit. Two, when I could take a hit, it tasted terrible. Three, I'm not really feeling super buzzed right now by any means. Four, because I, honest, honestly, because I, I couldn't take any hits, I think I'd be feeling a little bit buzzed if I actually could take hits. Uh, four, um, it just tasted terrible. Five, it was super, super, super rough. And, and six, just a terrible experience as a whole. No, do not roll a cigarette with toilet paper and try to smoke it. I thought that this was gonna be a really funny experience that was gonna kinda work kind of thing, but not work very well. And it turns out it actually doesn't work at all. Um, I'm never gonna do this again, nor do I have any desire to do this again. Uh, rolling a cigarette with toilet paper was genuinely one of the worst experiences I have ever had. And that, that's honestly saying a lot, uh, in all honesty. I've had a, a good amount of not such great experiences with smoking things and everything like that kind of thing. And um, this was one of the worst experiences. This was one of the first worst experiences and experiments I've ever tried. Uh, I ain't gonna lie, absolutely terrible experience. Absolutely terrible. I never want to do this again. No, never again. Yep, I think that's a pretty good summary of my thoughts. Uh, never want to do this again. Don't recommend it. And um, yeah, overall, just a terrible experience. Uh, one of the worst little experiments I've ever done on this channel, for sure. Um, yeah, nope, never gonna do this again. Nonetheless, though, I certainly hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video where I well rolled a cigarette with toilet paper to cure my diarrhea. Did I cure my diarrhea? Well, thankfully, I didn't have any to begin with. But if you guys enjoyed watching this video, of course, please make sure to well, like and subscribe for more content. I have my Instagram, my book, my merch, my P.O. Box, and my uh, second channel all in the description down below. Go check it all out. But, you know, thank you very much for watching, y'all. Till the next one, stay safe and peace and have a great one. Yes, sir, yes, sir. You know what I'm saying? I'm saying.